In the past six weeks since the coronavirus outbreak started, around 30.3 million people have filed for unemployment, citing the U.S. economy further into crisis. Being one of the worst strings of layoffs on record, economists have predicted that the unemployment rate could rise to as much as 20 percent, the highest rate since it reached 25 percent during the Great Depression. With businesses failing and tens of millions of workers being laid off, the economy is expected to diminish in the April-June quarter by as much as 40 percent at an annual rate. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. And to the republic for which it stands. One nation under God. Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey guys, it's Shaddy and Zoe time. Can't wait to get back and see you, hopefully soon. And tell you all my shopping stories, of course I've had none right now. <laughs> Can't wait to see you, hope all is well. Bye! Hey, yes, um... This is Mr. Kissling here. Hi, it's Miss Van Beveren. I miss you guys very much. Hello, it's me, Mr. Brandon. Hey, ESM, it's Mr. Robinson. ESM, Mr. Causer here. Hope everybody's doing well. Hi, it's Mrs. Trevison. Hi, everybody, it's Mrs. Mediga. Good morning, ESM, Mrs. Hillowa here. Hey, everybody, it's Mrs. Corbett. I miss you guys, each and every one of you. I really, I really do. I am binge watching Killing Eve, and I just finished binge watching um, all the Marvel movies all in order. So that was really fun. I am binge watching lots of different things. I watched uh, The Morning Show on Apple Plus. I watched Tiger King on Netflix. Uh, Carol Baskin killed her husband. Whacked him. I'm currently watching Ozark on Netflix, so no spoilers there, please. And I got me some of that Disney Plus now, so I'm watching the last 10 years of Disney movies I have not seen. So, I'm binge watching plenty. Hey, ESM. So what have I been binge watching? I've been trying to get caught up on Manifest and This Is Us. Huge fan of This Is Us. Um, Frozen 2 is a hot one here. Hot topic here. Fireman Sam, huge binge. Um, Ozark, The Last Dance, and basically anything MTV. All right, what have I been binge watching? Uh, Hunters on Amazon Prime. I'm not going to say it because Neuhaus is going to jump all in, but I've seen that show with the big cat. Um, Narcos on Netflix. Narcos Mexico on Netflix. O.J. Simpson Made in America. Last Dance ESPN. The Last OG TBS. Prodigal Son. And Schitt's Creek. If you think I watch it a lot, it is my job. I teach television and film. Believe it or not, it's been All-American. Uh, I watched it and I loved it. It was awesome. What have I been doing with my time? Well, I've been boning up on some old Saturday Night Live clips, trying to get ready to teach AP Gov next year. That would be Brooklyn Nine-Nine. I think it's pretty hilarious. Uh, Pennyworth. We finished season one of Pennyworth on Epics. It's a pretty good show. Check that out. Starting up on Ozark now. Of course, like everybody else, we've seen Tiger King. Carol Baskin killed her husband. Whacked him. <laughs> Carol Baskin killed her husband. Um, SNL at home. I thought that's been really creative. And also something called Self Made. Uh, Madam C.J. Walker. She was the first self made uh, African American female millionaire. Little Fires Everywhere on Hulu. It's really good. It's well acted. It's well written. It's about timely, relevant topics. I recommend it. Actually, my streaming habits are um, Schitt's Creek, Ozarks. King, Tiger King. Carol Baskin killed her husband, whacked him. Also, the Waco documentary series and the McMillions. So basically documentaries is white collar and it's like a crime mystery show. Pretty good. You can see it on Hulu if you're interested. Cuomo. Hey, he's amazing. He's doing a great job. Today we will have a high of 67 with a 50% chance of rain showers. Tomorrow looks to be mostly cloudy with some possible rain showers and a high of 60. Saturday and Sunday are going to be mostly cloudy, but we'll have highs in the 60s. Monday, we will have a high of 56 with cloudy skies, and Tuesday is expected to be sunny with a high of 50. I'm Gabby with your weather.
Lakers star LeBron James and his foundation are partnering with the XQ Institute and the Entertainment Institute Foundation to present Graduate Together for the class of 2020. The show will feature LeBron, uh, Nobel Prize winner Malala, soccer star Megan Rapino, along with musical performances by Bad Bunny, the Jonas Brothers, and Pharrell Williams. It will be airing on May 16th on uh, ABC, CBS, Fox, NBC, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Snapchat, and even TikTok. That's a lot. Um, in more local news, however, uh, Syracuse University plans to resume on-campus classes and what that means for college football. Um, the college football is still estimated to start September 5th. And I'm John Williams Sports.